Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be taking a look at the newly released interactive H1Z1DB map for King of the Kill. The map will have native support for tablets as tested on an iPad. The guys have added a number of features to keep players engaged, informed, and occupied while waiting for matches. When you first arrive on the map, all the various menus will be collapsed. The items menu and squads will have the triangular select and you'll see the zoom and lock icons all minimized to give you a nice clean interface. By hovering your mouse over a particular location, you can simply double click and it'll set a location. You can also let your squad and guildmates know that you are at D5. This will work dynamically with the upload manager. So as you move or zoom in and out, it will all correlate with the upload manager. You can also go in game, do your slash location, copy paste it here, put it in the string. This will work also to help your guildmates know where you are located. To the right of the map, you have the yield spawn selector. You can simply click on these to find the various types of spawns and their locations. They'll be indicated by their respected color. These red indicators here are points of interest. You simply click on those and it will also outline what the particular point of interest is along with what it yields. The H1Z1 DB team appreciates everyone who participates in providing them with these particular locations. The map also features a shared trading community with H1Z1 traders. You'll need to be connected to Steam to utilize the trade shared capabilities. And you'll also have the profile information system that will give you more detailed information about traders. The Upload Manager version 0.7 acts as a gateway between H1Z1DB's map and the in-game map experience. The sync process does not violate third-party terms from Daybreak. It does not interfere with any of your game files and it doesn't read your memory nor inspect network traffic. Everything sets separately. Be sure you stop by the H1Z1DB website and take full advantage of this incredibly useful gameplay feature. All the information concerning the H1Z1DB map and website can be found in the published section below. I've not posted an updates notes video for this Thursday, April the 28th, but you can see the release notes that are included for this update here on this annotation. They are the quality of life changes that were added on the test server. Thanks for watching everyone. If you're new to my channel or a frequent visitor, consider subscribing so you'll have all the latest news and information concerning H1Z1.